Hey Michael. Hi. We are taking a new avenue today, as you know, and I'm going to ask you some really pointed questions and uh, have you answer them and uh, give your audience uh, some more information that way. You talk about your product uh, being a raw whole food, seeing as how it comes in a package. Can you explain that, please? Yes, Agnes. Thank you for giving me the hard questions. It, one of the hardest things I have to do is try to explain the very complicated without making it more complicated. So I'm going to try to do that by explaining some terms so that it will be more easily understood. We hear the term raw all the time. So when I talk about raw, I mean that it hasn't been heated or processed or cut up or mechanically changed to denature it. The second thing that you asked about was whole. So whole, in my mind, or at least when I talk about it, means that the food is as close to its original form as possible. And that is where this becomes a problem with the packaging. The product we're talking about is a complete protein that is whole and raw. So hopefully that is the piece in the puzzle that's going to make this easier for people to understand. The reason I say that Immunical is a whole raw food is that all the ingredients are present. So to be a whole food, a food must have more than 51 amino acids in a chain. That's a long chain amino acid. So Immunical has more than the prerequisite 51 amino acids in the long chain. That makes it a whole and complete food on its own. So now we have a raw whole food that is complete and it could be part of your diet and take up a food slot so that when you start taking it you'd actually want to take less protein. So if you had bacon and eggs in the morning and you plan to take your Immunical in the morning, you'd skip your bacon and eggs and you would replace it with your Immunical protein in the right amount to replace the protein you otherwise would have ingested. Uh, where this becomes really important is if you're protein sensitive or if you're an athlete and you want to take more protein, you can simply add the Immunical at a different time to all the food you're already ingesting. It all depends why you're taking the product. Some people want to end up with less calories at the end of their day and some people calories aren't the object because they want to build muscle mass and have performance so they can do endurance training or strength training or build up muscle mass. So all these things are possible with the same raw whole food because it provides the basic building blocks your body needs to repair and rebuild itself naturally. The only limiting factor your body has is the availability of the essential amino acids it needs to repair and restore your body. So the Immunical protein is complete and whole so it has everything in it that your body needs to work properly, cleanly and efficiently. So I hope that answers your question without writing a book or spending a half an hour spelling out a whole bunch of crazy scientific details. Thanks Agnes. No, that's great. That does explain it really well. Um, in a previous conversation you and I have had off camera, we talked, or I mentioned the fact that I always think of raw whole food in its three-dimensional nature state, whereas what it in fact means is more of um, its makeup and its properties. Absolutely. One of the problems I have coming from a food background, because I was a professional chef for over 20 years, is I assume that when I say uh, this is a whole food that you know what I'm talking about but I would only be true if you were a cook with 10 or 20 years experience or had gone to a cooking class and taking nutrition or if you were a dietitian or you were a practical nurse that helped people with their diets or worked in a place where the food was part of your job but just because I've had the experience and understand doesn't mean that the people listening to me or I'm trying to explain to have the same knowledge today. So thank you for pointing out that I don't always provide all the information and that I need to take a step back and explain all the pieces I understand so you can come from the same point of knowledge so you can understand what I'm explaining. No, you've done a great job. 
and hopefully that explains it for your audience as well. Hopefully they're in the same boat I was in. Thanks, Michael. Bye for now.